Hi guys, welcome back to another video, and this one's going to be a Game Boy modification from Ben Ven. Now it's the last ever Freckle Shack mod um, that is is done. It's uh, it's completely discontinued now. Uh, I'm part of the last group of people that got the um, last shipment. Um, what he's actually doing is uh, got a new screen that's coming out. There's apparently, from what I've heard, don't quote me on it. It's you know minimal case modification and it's you know dropping as the freckle shack was, um, but it also fits the full diameter of the Game Boy Color. I've got the freckle shack. That's what I've paid for. That's what I'm going to be installing today. Okay, so to do this test, we're going to use the Pokemon Crystal. I'm just going to show you what the game looks like before, as you can see the screen's quite greyed out, this is obviously an unmodded Game Boy. So this is what the screen looks like currently. Bear in mind I have got a light shining directly on this. But this is the nature of these. You'd have to angle it at funny positions and all sorts just to try and see the screen. This is what okay, so because I'm using a uh, ancient phone, I've actually lots of footage of me dissembling this and doing this. It doesn't matter, there's loads of footage online on how to do this. All you have to do is trim away parts of this case here and I had to just cut around the edges a little bit as well just remove that old tape and just smooth it down a little bit and I got some um, bit of abrasive paper on there and just smoothed it down okay so this is what you get in the kit so I've already attached this to the board again I lost the footage all you have got the conversion board which is why you need to trim that down it goes into the original screen there and then this hits into there, folds over like so, and then away you go. Um, you've also got these 3D printer pads here, just to space it out to make it right. Sorry about the flickering, it's the light, I've got some new LEDs here which are helping but I've got a old halogen above. And also I've got a, I've got a new screen, just a glass screen and a bottom line because the old one was scratched to hell. Anyway, I'll get this together and then I'll just show you the um, outcome. Um, in the kit you also get Game Boy Call light sticker from Ben Ben. Right, I'll just put it together, show you what it looks like the outcome. Again, there's been loads of videos of people doing this and building it. I'm not gonna go to that, you can find loads. I'll even put a link in the description to one I found quite useful for this. Um, so yeah, so if you wanna watch a uh, not in-depth how-to, I'll, I'll provide one as a link. Um, but I'm just gonna get this to show you the final product. So that's the Ben Ben mod installed. You won't tell much difference to be fair. Here we go. Wow. There you have it, the last ever Freckle Shop mod. I've changed the game part way through because the battery needs change on the Game Boy, on the um, Pokemon Crystal game. So I've got South Park in, that's what you've seen in the video. This is an original game, as you probably, some of you probably know. Um, they never released it, they ended up backing out, but someone released the ROM online, and then someone else has made the cartridge, I got it off eBay. 
So yeah, that's the mod. The new mod that is releasing that replaces the Freckle Shack gets rid of those lines that fills the actual entire screen area. It doesn't bother me really uh, at the moment. I'm happy with this. Um, I am looking forward to that mod, but I'm more looking forward to the Game Gear mod that is releasing soon um, because that console is just absolutely not usable at the moment. You try and play a game on it, you can't see what you're doing clearly, it's flickering, it's horrible, the power drain on it, it's, it's unreal. So yeah, I am looking forward to more products because Ben and his team over at Ben Ben have done an absolute amazing job on this product, it's, it's amazing quality, I'm really, really, really chuffed with it. Can't wait to get it used while I'm out camping. I've also been approached by Chase and Brands again to do another video, so looking forward to that. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed that video, please consider liking, sharing, subscribing, and hitting that notification bell for more videos. Your support keeps me going. Without it, there is no channel. So thank you very much for all of you that are currently subscribed, that watch the videos, that like the videos, etc. Um, it's really appreciated. Until the next video.